Tamiladu, Minister PTR and State BJP G. Manamalai wage a war on Twitter. Now, Pali Nivel, Thiaga, Rajan and BJP State President have engaged in a war of words over Tamil Nadu's growth rate. It all began with the BJP posting, quoting Prime Minister Modi's resolution for Tamil Nadu's development earlier on his visit to the state. He slammed, he had slammed Stalin government for stalling development. A PTR countered, citing statistics showing that Tamil Nadu's growth surpasses the national average. PTR continued to defend Tamil Nadu's growth trajectory with more statistics highlighting potential challenges under the current central leadership. Anamalaya has dismissed PTR's claims, emphasizing future prospects over past data. The debate intensified as Anamalaya mocked PTR as disgruntled minister moved out the finance portfolio as making tall claims contrary to the facts. A listening to the Prime Minister's speech excerpt that led to this war of words over the growth rate of Tamil Nadu. <laughs> ये पॉलिटिकल पार्टी की आइडियोलॉजी नहीं बोल रहा हूं न मेरी आइडियोलॉजी बोल रहा हूं मैं डेवलपमेंट के काम की बात कर रहा हूं लेकिन मुझे मालूम है तमिलनाडु में कई अखबार हैं कई टीवी चैनल हैं जो इन खबरों को छापना चाहेगी दिखाना चाहेगी लेकिन यहां जिस प्रकार की सत्ता है वो उनको ये नहीं करने देगी लेकिन उसके बावजूद भी हम तमिलनाडु की सेवा में कभी रुकेंगे नहीं विकास के कामों को अटकने नहीं देंगे शिल्पा नायर गेरिंग आस मोर डिटेल्स ऑन दैट स्टोरी शिल्पा दिस इज अ फाइट अबाउट फैक्ट्स एसेंशियली समथिंग दैट इज बीइंग सेड बाय द बीजेपी the Prime Minister and uh, countered by the DMK there. Just talk to us a little about what this controversy is. Uh, well, yes, Neha. In fact, uh, when Prime Minister Narendra Modi was on a two-day visit to Tamil Nadu, in uh, both the public meetings that he attended, the primary focus was, of course, to highlight uh, the work that the Union BJP government has done for Tamil Nadu, the various schemes, the various developmental projects that uh, the Union BJP government has implemented. Uh, 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 speaking about that, you know, the Prime Minister, of course, then went on to say that Tamil Nadu should match or should keep up with the India's growth pace. And that comment of the Prime Minister, of course, has not gone down well with many in the DMK. In fact, uh, DMK Minister Mr. Palliwel Tiagrajan, someone who's known to be a very vocal minister in the DMK government, he has hit out at the BJP and the Prime Minister saying that why would anyone want to slow down Tamil Nadu's growth because he has put out some data which suggests that Tamil Nadu is growing more than the Indian average and apart from that, several other DMK leaders have also been highlighting that Tamil Nadu is much ahead, uh, you know, in terms of the national average and even ahead of other states when it comes to several human developmental indices. So why would anyone want to slow down Tamil Nadu's growth is the criticism that the DMK, of course, has been putting forward uh, in response to uh, PTR's uh, social media post. Tamil Nadu BJP Chief K. Annamale also put out a few other data points saying that, uh, no, Tamil Nadu isn't really doing that great in terms of economic growth and uh, other, uh, you know, factors. So there is, of course, a war of words and a war of numbers that is, uh, of course, taking place on social media platforms between PTR and Tamil Nadu BJP Chief uh, K. Annamale. And just yesterday, Tamil Nadu Chief Minister and DMK Chief M.K. Stalin also took objection to what the Prime Minister said, because the Prime Minister had also accused the DMK of trying to obstruct centrally sponsored schemes, saying that the state government is not cooperating with us to implement some of these schemes. Uh, so the Chief Minister, while he wrote a letter to his party cadres yesterday, he uh, you know, uh, questioned, or rather he asked for a list from the Prime Minister, saying that you, know, you should give us a list of these schemes which you think we are blocking, because we have not blocked any of these schemes. Uh, yes, we are opposed to certain policy decisions of the BJP, such as the NEET examination, or the farm laws, mm -hmm. or the controversial citizenship amendment act because we believe these are not in the interest of the tamil people uh, but we have not blocked any of these centrally sponsored schemes yes. is what the chief minister has said and he also uh, you know uh, questioned uh, the uh, uh, the prime minister over some of these uh, what they he says are sl slanderous statements so clearly uh, right. you know, so the prime prime in fact there is a massive the controversy apart from this also exploding over dmk's ad over the pm's Inauguration of the Istro spaceport in Tamil Nadu after DMK posted an ad in Tamil papers showing Chinese rockets with not a single Indian rocket or a flag anywhere. BJP is hit back the DMK yet again today taking a dig at the Chief Minister. The BJP wished him on his birthday today in Mandarin. Earlier, the Prime Minister accused DMK of insulting Indians and our Istro scientists lashing out during his 
Tirunelevi rally, the Prime Minister said the DMK was blind to India's progress. Shilpa, in fact, continues to be with us. Shilpa, that poster was put out by the Bharatiya Janata Party unit of Tamil Nadu, their mocking Chief Minister M.K. Stalin on his birthday today. Well, that's it. In fact, uh, DMK Chief and Tamil Nadu Chief Minister MK Stalin is celebrating his 71st birthday today. And uh, the BJP, of course, using this as an opportunity to take a dig at the Chief Minister and also the DMK. Because remember, when the Prime Minister was visiting Tamil Nadu, he had laid the foundation stone for the new launch pad of ISROs at Kulisegra Patnam. And during, on that day, the DMK Minister Anita Radhakrishnan had given an ad, uh, advertisement in the local newspapers here. And in that particular adver advertisement, there was a rocket that was seen with a Chinese flag on it. And this, of course, was picked up by the BJP. Uh, this was picked up by the Prime Minister, too, when he was speaking uh, in the public meetings. The Prime Minister uh, you know, went on to say that this uh, shows that the DMK is trying to insult our ISRO scientists, that the DMK doesn't want to speak about India's achievements in the space sector. And uh, the Minister, of course, later clarified that you know, this was a mistake from the part of the designer, and this was overlooked by the DMK leaders, and there was no other intention behind this ad. Uh, he said that this was a genuine error that was overlooked by the DMK leaders. Uh, but nevertheless, the BJP, of course, on the occasion of Chief Minister's birthday, they've put out a social media post saying that we are wishing the Chief Minister in his favorite language, trying to suggest that, you know, we are wishing him uh, in Mandarin. Uh, and they right. put up a post with the Chief Minister's face, also wishing him happy birthday. Uh, so uh, th there is, of course, uh, that controversy also. But the D DMK is also hit out at the BJP saying that the Prime okay. Minister has a Hawkeye vision to look at these Chinese flags on a rocket, but he is turning a blind eye to the Chinese incursions that, hap that are happening. Okay. Okay, Shilpa, thanking you for the moment for getting us those details.